guys. Just wanted to share a, a present I got for my birthday early February. Um, this is a Slam Kicks magazine, special collector's issue. It uh, talks about the Jordans from uh, Jordan 1 to Jordan 6. Although I'm not a crazy Jordan guy, uh, I have like maybe six, seven pairs of retros. Uh, I do appreciate the ones a hell of a lot. And um, it's a really cool read. A lot of pictures, which is what I'd like. And I uh, just want to share with you guys a quick look through this magazine. If you're interested, maybe you should go take a look at this. I have no idea where you get this. Uh, maybe your local magazine stands, I'm not really sure. If you're in Canada, I think uh, you can pick these up at your local shopper's drug mart. Anyway, let's get right into this magazine right here. Retail is 11 bucks. It's got a ton of OG pictures uh, if you want to take a look. Sponsored by Foot Locker, there's your flight. Jordan 1, all the way through 6. Here's the OG pictures I was talking about right there. Here's the bread. You got a ton of pictures of Jordan. You got some information. You got some modern players. Here's the DeMar DeRozan and the Air Jordan 1. I don't know how he balls in them. Those are so freaking uncomfortable. More MJ, 2s. You can see how some of the 2s are starting to crumble. More MJ pictures, 3s. You got some fours, modern players, Joe Johnson right there, fives, Dorn Beckers, really cool read, let's jump to the six, and then pretty much go all the way to the back, another pair of OG ones, really cool read, uh, definitely recommend this if you're a Jordan lover, or even if you're just a sneaker collector, the Jordan 1 to 6 is one of the most popular shoes, definitely, maybe not the twos, it's kind of slept on, but anyway, uh, let's get on to the next read. The next one here is more of a picture book. Shows you a ton of concepts. Uh, there's not a lot of text in here. Well, actually there is, but uh, it's only little bits of information. It's called Art and Soul right there. Just as a quick look if you want to pick these up off of Amazon. There's just a ton of concept pictures. Um, if you want to learn about all the other brands that exist. Of course, you got your Nike and Jordan. Got a bit of New Balance, Crooked Tongues. All these other brands that exist in the sneaker world. Just if you if you want to design shoes, you want to start somewhere. Uh, I think that's a LeBron Soldier, right? Yeah, that's a no, that's a Zoom LeBron Three. It's the fours. Yeah, I'm sure there's some bands in here as well. It's concept art. Here's some bands. Spider by the Simpsons. Uh, I think that this is a really cool book. Uh, I haven't actually read through this yet. Um, Definitely if you are a fan of designing shoes or anything like that, here's a Dave White. I think uh, there was a collab with the Air Jordan 1. This is probably my favorite picture. You got the, the plane and the Air Jordan 5. That's where the inspiration came from with the shark teeth. Threes, ones, what else is in here? A6, Air Maxes, a ton of Air Max pictures. Uh, looks like uh, Air Forces. Air Maxes, Air Maxes, really cool stuff, just concept art, I want to take a look through this, definitely recommend this if you are into designing. Uh, this book here, I never really had the time to look through it after I ordered it, I had a spree of just ordering sneaker books, just thought it was really cool, this one's really cool right here, this is called the sneaker book, bright green, you got your pink laces, coming out of the book spine, I think this one has a ton of pictures as well. Uh, this one here is a little bit more about Runners, Converse, a ton of brands back in the 40s, the 50s, 60s, 70s, look at that, it covers even the superstars, uh, where does it go up to, 70s, you got your waffles, 80s, just a ton of Runners are starting to come back, Mizuno, Bauer, Stan Smiths, it's really cool stuff, what else is in here? See, this stuff is coming back right now. The Sakani Jazz, or sorry, Sakoni. I don't even know how to say it. You guys teach me. See, look at that. I'm pretty sure, I think, uh, what's his name? Yoanti picked up a pair of those. Looks really similar to me. Asics, Asic Technology. Just a ton of stuff in here. It's really cool read, New Balance. And uh, that ends that one. I should give that a read. It looks pretty cool. Uh, what else I got here? This is my second favorite book. I will show you my favorite book at the end, of course. Sneakers, the Complete Collector's Guide. Really like this one. A ton of pictures. Actually has a ton of information. As you can see here, it got Nike, Adidas, uh, what else? New Balance, 
ton of pictures. You got Trainer Ones. Covers a ton of uh, retro shoes that are coming back out currently. You got the Nike Hirachi right here. Really cool. Uh, any shoe that you can think of that's been retro is probably already in here. Nike Hirachi Trainer, Trainer Hirachi Light, Air Max 90s, Ones, Safaris, the Waffle Trainer, the Marathons, of course. Uh, New Balance. Everybody's loving New Balance nowadays. 576, whatever you call it. Adidas. Back in the day with Run DMC, equipment training, basketball Y3 Converse, Converse this, Dunks, Air Jordan 1, you gotta, you gotta know the Air Jordan 1, you can't love sneakers and not know the Air Jordan 1. Kids, Pro Kids was in back in the day. Uh, according to that documentary I watched, it's called, uh, I for actually forgot what it was called, but I'll link you guys in the description. I thought it was really interesting. Uh, Pro Kids, Puma, everybody knows this shoe right here, the pumps, for tennis, Vans, everybody loves their Vans, ton of pictures, ton of information, Ewings, these are back, or the Timberlands. Sakoni Jazz. Hope your auntie sees this. It's really cool. What else is in here? Diodora's in here. Anyway, let's get right into my favorite sneaker book of all time. Um, these were, This book is selling for a crazy amount online. I don't know why. I think I picked this up for 30 bucks. It was a pre-owned copy. Uh, but here we go. This is the sole provider. 30 years of Nike basketball. Words by Robert Scoop Jackson. Uh, this is a really cool book. Um, I love Nike basketball. Um, I wish there was a Adidas basketball version of this. That'll be really cool. Uh, or just basketball from all brands. That'll be really cool. Let me know if you guys know of a book like that. Uh, that's not a killer price. Simple book. And uh, let's get right into it. It covers from, let me just take off the cover here. Has a different shoe under. You got the blazer, you got the Jordan. And uh, let's get right into it here. Ton of pictures, that is what I like to see. Uh, let me just see here, it covers from 1972 all the way to 2003. So anything you see in the retro market right now, you'll probably it's probably in this book. Like uh, you can probably go through this and just remember all the shoes that you've seen on the players. Uh, I know a lot of people keep uh, East Bay magazines and find the shoes that they really love and uh, just wish they retro. But uh, let's let's just start from the back of the book, all the way from Bruin, the Blazer. Even got some lady shoes in here, the blazers as well. Here's the stuff that are familiar to us all. AJKO, Air Jordan 1, uh, Team Convention, Port Force High, Team Delta Force. A lot of these are just casual shoes nowadays, they're no longer basketball shoes. Um, just because there's so much more better options out there. Uh, we got Ultra Force, Pressures, those were like the pumps. Air Jordan 5s, really, really cool book. That looks like a Flight 89, but uh, actually says Air Force Low. Um, I've never seen that shoe before. We've got the Air Flight Hirachi right here. I wish they released this with the original bottom. Um, people keep telling me it's a really comfortable shoe, but uh, they released it with the B ball bottom instead. You got the Air Force Max in the corner down there. Um, anything else? Air Raid. Air Raid has come back, I think. I'm not sure. Don't quote me on that. The Raptor 7. What else? Air Max CB. Keep that corner right there. Else? Oh, Air Maestros. The Pippins. Air Ups. I think they just came back out. Air Force Max CB. Uh, Air Jordan 9. What else you got in here? The Deconstructs. Air Flight 1s. The Penny 1s. Um, up tempos, air pennies. It's really cool, really cool book. Air Max Sensation, the thing that, uh, what's his name? Uh, Chris Weber wore. Air Two Strong Highs, I think those came back out already. Uh, air Way Up, they came back out recently, I think just uh, the end of last year. You got your Pippins, much up tempo, more up tempo, Air Max up tempo. Uh, air Worms, I think that was, uh, what's his name? Uh, Rodman Shoe, but don't, don't quote me on that. On the other corner here, you see the Columbia's, Air Zoom Flight, Jason Kids. Air Money, Jordan 12s, Air Maestro, Air Penny on the other side. Everybody sees the shoe they really love right here. 
you've got a foam posit one, of course. It's really weird. Uh, you think that there'll be like a foam posit two or something if they call it the foam posit one. Uh, what else you've got? Rise up tempo, CB, penny three, Jordan thirteen, up tempos. On this side you got the gloves that just came back out right there. Pippins, garnets. I think they'll probably release the garnets with a different name. Penny fours. Total at full posit max. I think that was Duncan shoot before he went to Adidas. Set up glove. It's a really cool book. Like, you'd be amazed. Like, for some of those guys who was born in the 90s watching some of these players playing, you'd definitely enjoy this book. Again, this goes up to 2003. You got the flight posit that just came back out recently. The Air Jordan 15 that we'll probably expect next year after this year with all the 14s. Shocks BB4. 11 retro low. And uh, there's a Duncan shoe right there. Uh, flight posit KG. Darwin Light. Here's your five again. Up to 2001 now, you've got Red One Retro. And uh, what else have you got here? I don't see anything else I recognize. Flight Posit 3. I'm not sure if those came out yet. You guys let me know, I don't remember. Uh, the Air Zoom GP3. Those would be interesting. You've got your Concord 11 right there. Uh, more shocks, more posits. I don't see anything else I recognize right here. Air Jordan 17s. Here's the Jordan Team 1s that we are expecting. I think it was this year, I'm not really sure. What else we got here? Well, this is the last page. And uh, let's just take a quick look through the front. Again, this is one of my favorite books. We got pictures on pictures on pictures. Boxes, Jordans. We got the Olympic team in here somewhere. We got Jordan. We got phone posits, pen pennies, pippins. We got features on the Jordan 11. Uh, Barclays in here. Um, who else is in here? covers Nike technology as well. As you can see here, this is the encapsulated air technology. Air Forces. I'm sure Rashid Wallace is in here somewhere. MJ. Threes. Concept art. Giant ass poster of MJ's wingspan. I am not a role model. Lawrence Blackman. Again, just concept art, the Black Panther, Air Jordan 13, MJ. Well, anyway, that's pretty much the end of my video. Again, I highly recommend some of these books. Like, they're just so cool. MJ again. Just definitely go check out this book right here. Highly recommend this book. Again, this is called Soul Provider, 30 Years of Basketball. Definitely go check it out, and I'll uh, catch you guys later. Peace.